Yeah, good afternoon. It's been a while. I've been it's been a while working on the on the updated version of uh, trading national the Malaysian way of two point zero, which is which is here. It's here, it's here, it's here, it's here. Yeah, you can see it. The package is coming with a bountiful offer of trend line breakout strategy. Yeah. Now today, I'm going to show you something that I part of what I added of this I added in the new in this new manual. Yeah, uh, this is um, the validation of uh, SNR. Validation of SNR. Yeah, added some stuff you need to know that if there are those stuff are not there they are just like like a checklist for you to that increases the odds of you winning the trades it's really increases your probability thank god for the knowledge of um uh, smc or liquidity investment concepts be able to re refine the entry level very well so that you have a very very high probability trades set up for you yeah, it's not no, it is not all trades you have to you have to trade, look out for the potential ones. Yeah, look out for the one that will deliver results. Yeah, it doesn't you, you don't have to trade every day, no. Yeah. So let's go through the what are the two things you, you look out for? One of the one I presented, one of the one are the this thing I presented on my of the trading package uh, is the liquidity sweep. Yeah, what you must see, what you must see, plus uh, liquidity sweep. Which uh, these people talk about the uh, miss, you know, miss. Yeah, they refer to as miss in their own uh, in their own way. Yeah, <clears throat> if you don't see this in your in your touch, yeah, I bet you, it helps you to filter out good trade from bad ones from those ones that are not potential. Yeah. <clears throat> Like for example, here now, you see them happening here. See it here. This is a good sweep. This is a good sweep. Mm -hmm. This is the good sweep, right? Mm -hmm. Like miss what are RFT or the rest of them called uh, MISS Smith miss. Yeah, but, but I like I love to take it to the SMC concept as a equity sweep. Mm -hmm. Sweep here. So it taps into the line and went up high. Yeah. yeah. Then you have another one here. Have another one up at the up. See this? Hmm? Tap into it with a with what? Because this is already a sweep. Hmm? Came down, sweep it up and start moving or higher. You have another one here. Yeah, this is a gap, right? So we we'll talk about that. So this is what this is what we grow to now. So let's say you come here, you are here, right? You are here. Trading life, right? This is what this is a gap, right? And uh, we want to see, we want to see this price, um, this level being tapped into. If you got a rejection of it, I mean. There is sweep, right? Yeah. If, what, if you still don't know about sweep, you can still get it on the in the manual. Yeah. See get it on the manual. What I present here, yeah. So what do we mean by what do we mean by sweep? I put up the the introduction there, yeah, is the grabbing or taking up of previous candle side or low. So the valuation is necessary, essential for for your trade. Yeah, 
why is it necessary? See the sweep, 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 sweep. So let's go back to the let's go back to the, 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 the tree chart. So we play for to see this is a this is a gap, right? A gap is narrow. So what does the price tap into it? Mm -hmm. Then we withdraw. Can you see? This is for our time frame. Mm -hmm. We got a withdraw there. Then what happens? Is there a sweep? What the checklist is? Got a reject. Got a rejection, which is one with weak, weak, weak rejection. That's validation of the first validation, the checklist for your checklist, and with a close above. Close above. Above the level, the SNR. Then we have a we have a liquidity sweep. At the touch, it comes with liquidity sweep, right? So the checklist. This is your liquidity sweep. This is liquidity sweep here. Can you see it? Yeah, that's liquidity sweep. So we want to see as it closes here above it, you don't have a, a, a thing to do with it. You can you can take it low. So like 30 minutes. Thirty minutes. So we want to see a, a lot of frame breakouts, right? So we got this and the we got this out. This is a breakout. This is the liquidity sweep. Hmm? See how liquidity sweep he there on 30 minutes. I see it, which is sweet, on 30 minutes. So what you want to do is to put your stop loss below that sweep. So you target times four. Our first target will be times four or times three. Let's put that times four. Take profit. Yeah. This is ratio is times four. So price want to see price to tap into this. Mm -hmm. To tap into this. So this is a fresh level. This is a fresh level. To see price to tap into this. This place. And, and trigger our position. I see that. What do you see there? Another another good good point here. Mm -hmm. We tap into it. Then we have this another liquidity sweep here. As price tap into that level, I see that. So you can be layering up your this thing, your your position. So price tap into that uh, breakout of first and now. So our our order is triggered. The order is triggered and that's four. It will be hit. Got it right, right? So another one coming down. If you miss the first, this is if you miss the first, the first entry. Hmm? We got another one here. They are coming down. That's this is a break of SMS or BMS with a BMS, right? So just give you another good. Uh,
Yeah. So, so price tap into this, into this level. Mm -hmm. So you set up and I'll set up another another stop. Set up another stuff right here. So we are very careful of this place because it has not been tapped. In case this is good, can put it here first. Uh, if that place is tapped, or probably it goes off. So you, you maintain the, your your DC. You can see that. You can see that. You can see it. So when I told you, you have to be very careful of it because it has not been tapped, right? Press only tab this level. Mm -hmm. Press only tab that level. So you have to be very careful. See it. So we got another liquidity sweep here. Can you see it? So you can you can you can put this. You can put this. You can see enter new level here. Another new level. So that's how you stack up. You stack up. What they call what they call uh, the Malaysian calls the uh, uh, as uh, the term as layering. Yeah, layering. Layering of orders. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They are enough others. So you can put enough, enough. You get one, two, three, put on enough register. So your stop loss is just I amen. Mean, just 20 pips stop loss. So your listing is times times five or thereabouts. And I'm for in new it. You already it already hit one to three. Can you imagine that? Hmm? It's already hit or your your your, your take profit is hit and uh, you can imagine the, the pips the number of pips you have secured there this is almost about 231 pips hmm? using 20 pips using 20 pips 231 using 20 pips divided 231 divided by 20 pips 20 pips that equals 11 that's times that's times 12, 12, times 12, times 12. You can imagine that. Times 12. So that is how you don't trade without, without if, if because it gives us a very high odd of winning the trade. We got this here and move higher. You can imagine like this place now. So this is risky to trade against the currently because this is a matter of trade. You can see get something below down to this buy. Mm -hmm. Almost about 102 pips. Mm -hmm. So can imagine you can see you refine this place, this level into, into more comfortable stuff. So we can still refine this place. If you are the one, if you are good in a uh, uh, golfing, this is a good at uh, golfing zone. Hmm? It's a good at uh, golfing zone. So trade. It's a good at uh, golfing zone. So you can still refine it lower. Can I imagine? Still got your this here, a uh, golfing. And it's divided into two, two. That's almost about there. How many pips? How many pips there? So it reduces your your maximum exposure to risk. Almost about there. Almost about twelve pips. Twelve pips. But well, it's the, the 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 risk is high, you know. So the risk is high because this is good. You see, trigger this level. This is a fresh level. So it ends there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So your stop loss is here. And imagine how many pips from 12 pips to you know to that uh, from 12 pips to 239 pips. Hmm? 
That's how many? 239 pips divided by 12 pips. That gives almost about 20 times 20. Wow. So that's the, that's the benefit of trading with, uh, you know, trading with uh, LSR. At the touch. God bless you.